A banner at a Cranston high school is becoming a federal case. This afternoon, lawyers for the city of Cranston and the ACLU faced off in federal court for a hearing over whether the banner and its religious message should be removed. Eyewitness News reporter Nick Nuosu joins us now with the new details. Before arguments began this afternoon, the judge in this case stopped by Cranston West High School here to see the prayer banner for himself. From up close, far away, and even sitting down, federal judge Ronald Legue reads the Cranston prayer banner, beginning with the words, Our Heavenly Father, and ending with, Amen. The banner was a gift from the school's first graduating class 50 years ago. But one student says the banner deprives her of her rights under the First and Fourteenth Amendments. The ACLU is representing the student in a federal case, asking that the banner be taken down. Attorneys for the school say the banner is not meant to inject religion into public schools, but to maintain tradition. Students we spoke to agree. Everyone has their own different beliefs, but if only one person complained out of like literally a thousand people, then I think it should just stay, because not everyone like really cares about it, you know? After touring the school, banner, and other memorials and trophies at Cranston West, the judge and attorneys headed back to federal court to begin hearings. As we speak, both the prosecution and defense are making their arguments in court. The judge will hear those arguments and then come to a decision.